in the women's 200 freestyle. Lane one, representing the Nashville Aquatic Club, Alex Walsh. In lane two, from Riptide, Reagan Smith. Lane three, from the Alto Swim Club, Simone Manuel. Lane four, representing Nation's Capital Swim Club, Katie Ledecky. In five, from St. Petersburg and Georgia, Melanie Margallis. Lane six, from Club Wolverine, Gabby Duluth. In seven, from the Athens Bulldogs from Club, Haley Flickener. And in lane eight, from Germantown Academy Aquatic Club, Ali Ackman. Top qualifier is Katie Ledecky in lane number four, a time of 157.62 this morning. Ledecky, the 2016 Olympic gold medalist in the 200, 400, and 800 freestyle. She also holds the pro swim record in this event from 2016 at 154.43. American record, a 153.61 held by Allison Schmidt from the London Olympics in 2012. Schmidt also holding the U.S. Open record at 154.40. Ledecky with a body length lead, 56.97 split time at the 100 turn. One twenty six sixty five. Good first one fifty for Katie Ledecky. Ledecky, who ranks fourth all time, excuse me, third all time in this event with her best time of one fifty three seventy four. Pulling away from the field, fifteen hundred dollars to the winner here at the Tier Pro Swim Series, and the winner will be Katie Ledecky in a time of one fifty five seventy eight. Second was Simone Manuel at 158.52. And third, Melanie Margallis, 158.68, touching in third in the women's 200 freestyle. Great racing there in that women's 200 freestyle. Reminder, prize money on the line here at the Pro Swim Series. $1,500 for first, $1,000 for second, and $500 for third.
congratulations. You've been active on social media, kind of giving folks this week a background look at what it's like training at altitude in Colorado Springs. What's it like to get back in the pool here at the regular level and have your first race of 2019? You've now had almost a year as, a, as this transition to the pro format. How's that going? It's going really well. Um, I'm still, I still feel like I'm a part of the Stanford team a little bit. We were on their training trip in Colorado, so still feel very close to all those girls and I'm seeing them continue to do really great things in the water and in school and I'm still taking classes at Stanford so my day-to-day -day life doesn't look too different right now so it's, it's been a lot of fun so far. I was going to say, has anything changed for you as far as that training pattern? Do you feel any different as a pro kind of, uh, I'm putting this in quotes, going it alone a little bit as far as that full team concept? It's a little bit different. I think the biggest thing is my focus is just on long course right now, and I really like that just to have one focus. I have my goals for 2020, and I can really just attack those long course goals over these next couple of years. It'll be fun going along for the ride. Katie, thanks for the time. Thank you. Katie Ledecky, we'll see her again in the women's.